Phoenix for Go Calgary at Genesis Center, just off of Falcon Ridge Drive. You, Andrea, have brought some of your favorite little friends. What's going on this weekend? Uh, we have the Calgary uh, Reptile Expo this weekend. Uh, it's put on by Taurus, the Alberta Reptile and Amphibian Society. Who knew there was such a thing? Mm -hmm. We're a society that was established uh, in the 80s, so we've been around for a little while. Uh, and um, we're going to have a bunch of vendors in. We're going to have everything from face painters to an wow. interactive kids' corner. We're going to have uh, breeders. We're going to have um, displays. We're also going to have an exotic vet on site. So everything you need to know or want to know about snakes and geckos and anything else that's slimy, well, kind of, yeah, <laughs> this is where you go. <laughs> Absolutely, yeah. So you mentioned a kids' corner. Mm. So you actually are going to let the kids actually play with these snakes? Come on, Andrea. Yeah, yeah. That's going to make a parent crazy. You know what, everything uh, in the kids' corner, it's all animals that we've handled really frequently. They're all yeah. out of private collections. They belong to Taurus uh, volunteers. There's also uh, Taurus members that are going to be on site with the handling. So nice. it's not like we let the kids just run off on their own. Because that would be really, really cool. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, up to a point anyway. Up to a yeah. point, yeah. So this, there's, okay, so what do you have? You have snakes? Yep, we have uh, lizards, we have chameleons, we have a bunch of different geckos, leopard geckos, wow. crested geckos, um, pretty much everything that you could want for a domesticated at-home pet who's going to be at the show. So why is it important to show off these beautiful little animals? Look at this guy. He wants out of his bin. Why is it important to show off this little guy? There's actually a lot of misconceptions uh, surrounding reptiles in general. Uh, they make amazing pets, mostly they're relatively low maintenance compared to a furry pet. Uh, yeah. As well, they're also completely hypoallergenic. You're not going to have any type of allergic reaction to them. They don't shed um, hair. Don't shed hair, yeah. shed skin, but not hair. Wow. Um, and they just become really good companions. You get to know them very intimately and they get to be just like family. Know them intimately. We're going to get to know some of these wonderful creatures intimately in just a few minutes. More of Go Calgary coming up on Shaw TV. He's not going to bite me, is he?